Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to do a quick little video to let you guys know that I'm not sure if I will be able to upload any videos for the next week. I'm going to try really hard. Um, yesterday I dropped my phone in the snow and today it stopped charging. So um, I brought it to T-Mobile and they told me that I had to file a claim and when I tried to file the claim, I have to pay $99 before the claim will even be started. So um, I do not have $99, obviously. I have to wait till my next paycheck. So um, next week I will be filing the claim and then what what happens is they send me the phone and then I send in my, my old phone. So... Um, right now I am able to charge it wirelessly, but it is a very slow charge. It probably, what would normally take 30 minutes, 40 minutes to fully charge, it's going to take 8 hours to fully charge. So I don't know how much I'll be able to be on my phone, and I don't know how it's going to hold up throughout the working day. I work 10 hours and have a 2 hour commute. So, I don't know, hopefully I'll be able to come home and throw it on there and get it charged up just enough so I can record because I really love recording and I'm really upset about this, but I just hope that I don't lose any subscribers, that nobody leaves because I'm still here and I promise as soon as I get my phone fixed, then I will be back to making my videos. So, um, I will include some clips from earlier today when I went to... Big Lots, and um, I think I took another little video. I'm not sure. Whatever. Anyways, I'm here. You can contact me on Snapchat, on my Instagram, on my Twitter, in the comment section. I always reply to you guys. Might not be right away because I might be sleeping or I might be at work, but I will always reply to you guys. So if you have any questions or, or just want to talk or anything like that, you know where to find me. Bye, guys. Well, since we had the big snowstorm, um, I've since realized my kids don't have very many gloves because, you know, they like to lose every pair of gloves I've ever bought them. And I had just bought them a, each a pair before winter started and now they're all gone. So the boys have like an option of a pink glove and a black glove and they just won't do that. So. They did wear them outside, though, to play in the snow when the snow first came. But now, going to school, they're not going to wear one pink glove and one black glove. So, also, they want gloves that are warmer. You know, not just those little knitted ones to keep your hands warm. Actual ones to play in the snow. So, I'm going to go to Big Lots. I'm going to see what they have for gloves. I know, usually, this doesn't make any sense, but usually, this time of the year actual winter when these are a necessity stores are all out of them and they've already put out their summer and spring clothes I do not understand stores sure I could go order some on Amazon but I would like the kids to have them tomorrow for school so it's Sunday oh they don't even have school tomorrow still it's Sunday I have my Eskimo coat on I love this thing it's like Hi. Anyways, it's hot. I don't wear the hood often because it's very hard to see. But I love this coat. When I, I got this coat last year, I bought it for myself for Christmas from Old Navy. And um, the sleeves are kind of short. But I just wear like a hoodie underneath it. So it's not noticeable. But um, it used to not. It, it, it would zip. But it would be very kind of hard. And now I have like all this space and it's so crazy. Okay, anyways, let's go. Okay guys, so I did um, find some gloves. They didn't have a lot of gloves. They had a very small selection. They had some like large adult black gloves and gray ones with the touch options and the fingertips for your cell phone so I think they might be a little too big for my daughter but I got her the gray pair and then my my oldest son the black pair even though he'll probably never wear them I can't even get him to wear a coat 
I know, 17 year olds. Um, and then I got the boys, they're a little too old for for the hats, I think. They're Black Panther, they do like the movie, but they're not so into wearing, you know, the things like that, they just turned 10. But they, the hat came with gloves and that was the only other option, so. I got those, I got freezer bags, I got some face cream, and paper towels, and my bath mat, and a mat for the front door because with the snow, bringing in all of that wet, shoe mess, gunky stuff, I hate it because I have tile as soon as you walk in and it always there's always puddles. So I have a towel right there for right now, but it looks meh. So hopefully this rug will kind of help eliminate some of that wetness because the bathroom is right there and you have to walk past you there and I hate getting my socks wet. I need to buy some slippers. <laughs> Good slippers because my feet are always cold. Anyways, okay. Oh my God, that bird just scared the crap out of me. All right, guys, I'm going to Starbucks. I'm getting myself a coffee. I think I want to get myself a warm coffee because I had this hot coffee and I've already drank it. And then, um, what are, this is how cold it is. It's actually uh, seven degrees right now in Michigan. All right, guys, see you soon. Okay, so I'm at Starbucks. I just went and got some wax worms for my son's gecko, and I need that Starbucks. So, what I'm getting today, I seen the Countess of Low Carb go to Starbucks yesterday, and I feel like it's a little too cold today for iced coffee, although I would like to save one for maybe later or tomorrow. Like, I like to keep them in the refrigerator for... The next day at work so I think I'm going to try what she had she had a, a venti mint majesty with um, heavy whipping cream and light ice because it was so hot and I'm the same way I can't drink hot things like super hot so I think I'm gonna get that and then my usual a venti iced coffee with um, three or four pumps of sugar-free vanilla and sugar-free cinnamon dulce with no classic and heavy whipping cream.